बसमीम् अलकुम स्टूडेंट्स हो आर यू फाइन इन्जॉय यूर वेकेशन डू यूर होमवर्क ऑन टाइम ऑफ ऑल सब्जेक्ट्स शोर स्टूडेंट स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर वेकेशन वी चेक ऑल दीज नोटबुक्स ओके रिमेंबर ओके स्टूडेंट्स एंड इन शफ्टर वेकेशन वी We solve these questions in your neat notebook. You can easily solve within seconds. So, to practice on daily basis, solve the question in your rough notebook properly. Follow all the steps. Okay, and one thing more: revise the table. It's so important. Okay, multiplication tables. Inshallah, after multiplication, we solve question of division. and division we also need we take help from multiplication tables okay student students in the previous lecture we solve question of three digit number with one digit number related tables are 2 3 4 and 5 mean dodging okay if you people solve the questions you can easily learn dodging tables okay and now today we solve the question again three digit number with one digit number okay but today the tables are 6 7 8 and 9 easy table student in the previous lecture i give the homework to devise these tables 6 7 8 and 9 dodging okay students students you practice more and more okay mathematics practice is so important written practice not orally you people can't solve these question orally you need written practice okay so now look at the board today we also follow the previous steps okay with the previous steps and we solve the question but the tables are changed questions are changed okay students when you people solve one question again and again you can solve it but when different tables are given then you people confused okay so we practice on these questions again and again okay to clear your mind now the questions is given in horizontal order 1178 multiply by 7 like this we arrange it in vertical order Okay, we write the place value and then write the question. We need one drop for carry. Okay, one hundred seventy-eight. The multiply number is seven. Means you people need table of seven. Okay, you can learn table or really students means no need to write the table in your rough column. You can do. Okay, do it. Okay. Remember, students. If you people write the table for yourself, look at to the greater digit and the question. And this question, the greater digit is eight. So when you people write the table, you people write the table just up to eight, like this. Seven. Look at here. Seven zero is zero. Seven ones are seven. Means we add seven one time. Answer is seven. Seven twos are great. Fourteen students, give me answer quickly. Seven threes are twenty-one. Great. Seven fours are twenty-eight. Seven fives are thirty-five. The greater number in this question is eight. So we write table of seven up to eight. Seven six are forty two. Good. Means you add seven six times. Seven sevens are forty nine. Will you add seven seven times? It's mean forty nine. And seven eights are fifty six. Okay. Again seven zero is zero. Seven ones are seven. Seven twos are fourteen. Seven threes are twenty one. Seven fours are twenty eight. Seven fives are thirty five. Seven six are forty two. Seven sevens are forty nine. And seven eights are fifty six. We start from our ones column. Our ones column. First digit is eight. 
you read and he writes it. But of seven up to eight, you people write that table just to confirm your answer. Okay, if you wish. Fifty-six. So again, we write the right one digit in the one column and carry the left one digit in the next column, which is tens. Correct. Fifty-six. We write six in one digit and carry five in the tens column. No, we read table of seven up to seven. Table of seven up to seven, not up to five. Students. First of all, we read table of seven up to seven. Seven sevens are forty-nine. Seven sevens are forty-nine. So simply we add five in forty-nine. After forty-nine, read out five more numbers: fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four. Great. Again, we write the ones the right one digit in the tens column and carry the left one digit in the hundred column. Again, five is carry. No, we read out table of seven up to one. Seven ones are seven. We simply add five in seven. Ten, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Answer is twelve. Again, here is no digit in thousand column, so we write answer directly. You people can easily carry this number in the thousand column. Clear, student? Clear? So when we multiply one thousand one hundred seventy eight with seven, the answer, the product, multiplication answer is called product one thousand two hundred and forty six. Clear? Next question. Okay, students. I solve next question for you people. Okay, which one question? Students, we solve the last one. Difficult, not difficult. Students, okay. Look at to this question. We solve this question. Okay, and you people follow the same method. Okay, in your rough notebook again. The question is four hundred ninety-eight multiplied. Any question is given. It's not important that the same digit is given. You people. Concentrate on the method, on the tables, not the digits. Okay, these digits are not repeated in the paper. Okay, nine. So we need table of nine. Yeah, we write. Ah, uh, we learn table up to eight. First of all, we read table up to eight. You people want to write table of nine? Why, student? People. Okay, right. Up to greater number. Which one is the greater number in the given question? Nine. So we write table of nine up to nine. Nine zero is zero. Nine ones are nine. Nine twos are eighteen. Great. Nine threes are twenty-seven. Great. Nine fours are thirty-six. Great. Nine fives are forty-five. Great. Look at to this table. One, two, three, and here descending order is here in number are decrease. Number are increase. Nine six are fifty-four. Nine sevens are sixty-three. Nine eights are seventy-two. Nine nines are eighty one. Okay, student. Clear. So first we multiply nine up to eight. Nine eights are seventy two. Seventy two. Yes, we write the right one digit in the ones column and carry the left one digit in the tens column. Good. Well done, students. Again, we read out table of nine up to nine. Nine nines are eighty one. Eighty one. The carry one digit is seven. Just eight seven in the ones. Eight. Answer is eighty eight. That's great. We again write our right side digit in the tens column and carry 
the left hand side is digit in the hundred column the next place value is the hundred so now we read table of nine up to four nine fours are thirty six thirty six we ate thirty six we ate eight in thirty six hurry up student thirty seven 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44. Yes, we write the right one digit in the 100 column and carry the left one digit in the 1000 column. No number to multiply. So, we write this 4 in the answer. So, when we multiply 4498 with 9, we get the answer 4440. Eight. Clear student? Students, you can solve the question now. You people copy this question in your rough notebook. Okay? And then arrange in vertical order. Okay? And then you people find out the answer. Writing should be neat students. Again, writing should be neat. Okay? And underline the question. Draw margin line in your rough notebook. Okay? Inshallah, after vacation, I check all these notebooks and again revise the table. Clear? You people first multiply your one digit, then when the answer is come, okay? Answer. You people write the right one digit in the first one column, demanded one, and carry the next one digit, your left side digit, in the next place where you carry. Clear? Okay? Don't merge these two numbers like here is 72. Don't like write like this. Then you people write 7 in 1 column and carry 2 in the 10th column. This is totally wrong and affect your answer. Okay? Thank you, student.